Hi, it's Mary from the Movement Studio, and today I wanted to talk a little bit about your rib cage and the position of your rib cage and your diaphragm. And I'm just going to give a little quick demonstration on three activities that help get your rib cage to go down and back, which reshapes the diaphragm, right? If our diaphragm, if we lay down and our ribs are splayed out, our diaphragm's on tension, that equates to stress and being upregulated and core weakness. So if we can get your rib cage down and back, that helps to reshape and redome that diaphragm. So here we go. Okay, this first technique is really simple. You're gonna stand with your feet about 10 inches from the wall, about hip distance apart. Slide down the wall and do a little posterior pelvic tilt. So I'm just pulling my pubic bone towards my chin. My back is going kind of into the wall. Keep your weight in your heels. And you're just gonna inhale through your nose, exhale all your air out, reaching forward. You can see what that does to my rib cage. It brings it down and back, or we could say internally rotating the ribs. If I stay here and breathe, and breathe into my back, that expands the back of my, the fascia behind my heart, and I exhale and I reach. Where people get into trouble with this one is that they reach too hard and they strain their neck. So just relax your arms, but gently reach forward with each exhale. You can also rest your arms on a chair if this is bothering your neck. But this is a great technique, as you can see, to so get the ribs down and back. So this next technique is really simple. You're gonna get on your hands and knees, and we're gonna lift one hand up as you exhale and round your back. So you just round it here, and you're just gonna lift one hand and get all your air out. You could blow a balloon or a straw here. And it really drives those ribs to go into internal rotation. Again, opening the back body and activating the oblique muscles, which is what we wanna do to get those ribs down. So again, this reshapes the diaphragm, okay? So you're gonna do five breaths here and five breaths here and repeat.